she just loves people and uh, and knows how to be with people and make them really comfortable. <laughs> She's probably a little too loving and too friendly and gets herself in trouble that way. Yes, we stick to the script once we get to set because we've already worked on stuff. So, uh, but there is, there is some playing around, you know, we're definitely, I definitely feel that I can play with it on the set, you know. Eugene and I have a good long history where, uh, you know, we're good friends and, and he lets me get away with it. Um, but no, we do, they have great scripts to begin with. They write great scripts to begin with. And then I make my notes. They, this year was great because we had a little more lead time and I actually saw outlines before I saw scripts. So I could put my two cents, ten cent, two cents in about, uh, you know, what Moira was going through. Uh, of course, I mouth off about other things, but they don't have to listen to that. And um, and then we get the scripts, and then I, uh, you know, offer whatever changes and ideas, and then, and uh, Eugene and the other writers are very collaborative, which is, and Daniel, very collaborative, so I appreciate that. And they seem to appreciate me, which is very nice. And uh, yeah, so by time we get to the set, we, we're all in agreement, and... You know, but it's all starting with great scripts to begin with. But, but I definitely have to make things my own. Yeah. Because I really, it's not like I'm really know what my character is. I think I'm actually quite inconsistent because I think Maury is kind of an inconsistent person depending who she's talking to. Um, so I'm, you know, I put on a show or I'm, you know, a little more open and vulnerable um, depending on who I'm with. Uh, but I still really protect my character. So. And I think that's my job. So if that, something, you know, if, if I can make my dialogue more Moira, I believe, than what's there, then fortunately I'm working with lovely smart people who allow me to do that. You know, I have avoided doing a series forever. I just thought I don't, maybe someday the Golden Girls, you know, and I'm probably at that age now. <laughs> something, I would always say that when I was in my 30s, 40s, like, do I do a series? No, maybe Golden Girls someday. That's a great show. Older women, sure. And you, and you want to be in the same place every week. And, you know, it's like going to the office. I always thought doing a series was like going to the office, the closest to a nine to five that an actor could have, you know, and they know if the series is successful, they know where they're going to be and what they're going to do. But it's never appealed to me. And, um, you know, and then, you know, I've done jobs here and there and I have uh, a teenager and a son who just turned 21 yesterday and I've always wanted to be home with my kids and be the mom I'm supposed to be. Um, so, you know, I've said no to a lot of work um, and it's all been worth it to be with my family. Um, and then Eugene, you know, did the pilot. What, Eugene and Danny were doing this pilot and they asked me to do it. And I said, well, you see, I won't be doing the series. And they go, oh, I know, uh, get some, you should get someone who's going to do the series. And then... And anyway, it's way too long an answer. You know, I, can't, I resisted. What I mean to say is I've resisted doing a series forever, and I resisted this, even though I love Eugene. And then, you know, then he calls me and says, oh, CBC is buying it. And we sold it to CBC, and we're going to shoot it in Toronto. And it got down to, we'll shoot it like, you can go to your cottage on weekends and get your cottage ready in a way that you've never been able to <laughs> up north <laughs> while you're shooting. And you've got family here. And you can do whatever you want with this character. And, uh, you know, and it finally hit me, st stupid and slow as I am, uh, like, what am I insane? Why wouldn't I do this? It's a fun thing. They're open to ideas. I'm the age I am. Where, where else am I going to be doing this? You know, Eugene I love already. Daniel, you know, I, don't, I didn't know him as a collaborator before this, but I'm so happy that he's so great. Um, Sarah's there, you know, working with lovely people, the crew's amazing. But I just finally clued in like, yeah, you'd be a fool not to take the opportunity. And, you know, it's nice to be alive, let alone working with old friends and doing some fun comedy. <laughs>